What's up, Star Wars Unlimited fans? It's Loopy here at Late Night Gaming, and set two is here. Well, it's here in a couple of weeks as the date of recording, but uh, Fantasy Flight was kind enough to send us a box to use for a pre pre release, so we're doing a sealed tournament, and here I am to open the pack. So, this is cool. I've been waiting for this set for a little bit. Let's get right to it. As you see, I have six brand new shiny packs of Shadows of the Galaxy. Uh, one thing I noticed about the box is that it actually uh, was collated with the three different packs one at a time. And we're going to lay these out. I'm going to be doing the uh, sealed build in a separate video so that people that just want to watch the card opens can just watch the card opens and people that want to watch the build can watch the build. But let's see what we have to work with. First is a Bokaton pack. All right, so we got a Hunter. Not exactly the leader that I'm looking for. Warzone Lieutenant. A Wookiee Pike Sentinel. Priority Battle Tank. Clan Challengers, which is a very strong card. Privateer. Resourceful. Bounty Hunter Initiated. IG-11. Zuckus, another strong one. We got Wrecker, uh, who might be the uh, best card in the set. Close, probably for overall power level. These lay these out how they go. Um, I'll talk to the about this more. I lay out pre release cards or any kind of sealed or draft in a certain way so I can kind of keep track and visualize things. So I'm doing that right now, and this will help us make some decisions when we're actually putting it together. Uh, Zuck is here, he's cool. He goes with Forlom, his buddy. Uh, he has Saboteur, and they buff each other. Alright, no legendary yet, but we got some good legends here. Alright, we got Finn, uh, keeping it on, the similarly powered leaders. Uh, we got a Jabba's Palace, Nima Outpost Constables, which is kind of a cool sentinel that they released in this set. We got the One Drop Red Saboteur, Timely Intervention. Uh, a great card. Uh, and we got a Wookiee. Gentle Giant is heroic. That is a neutral. McClunky. One of my, probably actually my favorite card uh, of the set. I've been playing a lot of yellow. A lot of Cad Bane decks. McClunky's good. I do get a Hyperfoil in this one. Which is wilding. Alright. And the rare was Enterprising Lackeys. Fennec Shand is an uncommon, it's kind of a bigger unit. Bounty Hunter's Quarry is an excellent bounty. The Client is an excellent card, period. And that is what we go with. All right, pack three. Oh my boy. Starfighter, Jahoff, this is actually a great card, I think, but hyperspace, we got a surprise strike which can be relevant, alright, we got the exhausty boy, Teal, I have spoken, ooh, look at that, hyperfoil mod. Great to draw cards. I don't know that Teal is that great unlimited. I suppose you could have enough. Your little thug is a reprint. And this is the way. Alright. Three down. Uh, that mall is an exceptionally powerful card. I like that. Alright. We got Ray, another leader I played a lot of. Navarro's. 
Reckless. Okay, the pirate card. Rickety. That's actually one of the ones that we uh, released on late night. The heroic Renegade, which is the grip guy. Uh, two drop. Uh, the Skull Pike Pursuer for one with a bounty. High Moban Enforcer. One is a very relevant card. We got another rare Tobias Beckett. Crosshairs. Switch Beckett's pen. Coruscant. Cloud Rider. And Usaban. Alright. We're still hoping for that legendary fuse. I brought out a Ray Kylo Man. Spice Mines Kessel, base. Hondo. Uh, this is a leader with smuggle synergy. Bill and Green. Uh, the Trandoshan Hunter. We got the Ramp Bounty. Uh, Price on your head, as it's called. Alright, first removal of the McClunky I've seen Rivals Fall. Uh, it's a six cost, kills literally anything. There's actually some Wookiee Tribal in V7. That's kind of cool. Relentless Pursuit, which is a great card for yellow. That guy is just really cool. All right. On this captain, safe Lady Proxima. Oh, my. This is cool. I actually have a budget deck I'll be releasing uh, with Cad Bane in red um, that relies on Lady Proxima, but I like the hyperspace of her a lot. That's cool. A lot of the hyperspaces with uh, the back... Darker backgrounds look great. Uh, so I guess she's a one neutral. Uh, this is a blue trick where you unex uh, effect of escape and take the opportunity. This is the uh, upgrade ship for five. And then overstrain. One pack to go. Assassin, who's the overwhelm guy for two. And he has to hit a friend, friendly unit. Goes well with grit, that kind of thing. And upgrades, fan brace. Moment to glory, super tactical advantage. Stuff that's there. This is a red card, detention block rescue, that does more damage if there's they're guarding the captured unit. Uh, we got the five cost sentinel that can be smuggled. Take captive. Another capture card in green. All right. And then we got the Hawk Freighter for three. The Wanted Bounty for yellow. General Recon is our rare. And we got the new adventure card in foil. All right. So those are the cards. General Recon. <laughs> Two new adventures. We got all kinds of adventures going on here in double yellow. All right, so no legendaries, but uh, we are going to put these together into a sealed deck for pre release next. Uh, thank you for joining us and check out the channel. If you like this kind of content, give us a like and subscribe. Blue Peace signing off.